Hi guys, okay, I'm back. So, I figured since, you know, I'm already recording, um, there was some things that I didn't mention in my May favorites, but, um, definitely, um, I have some, like, I guess you can call it like a mini haul, because I wanted to see the new, um, Mac, um, Surf, uh, what is it? Oh my goodness. The Surf's Up baby you guys know what I'm talking about so I did pick up two things um, that I liked um, from the Mac counter and um, they're always sending me like emails uh, to get like free shipping they'll upgrade to like second day air so um before that I had like ran out of a couple of things so um a mail or yeah like a mailing order, not mailing, but um, online order. I'm um, sorry, my eyes are like very sensitive. Um, I had ran out of my strip down, so I just got another, you know, and it's that real pretty. They have a lot of like neutral, so it's that just for me, it's a just right neutral. The other one I like is Fork um, from Mac. And then I got Snob, um, from the Surf Up Baby collection at MAC, there's like a purple, but I feel like I can dupe it with my Inglot, because I was really looking at it, and, um, it looks really vibrant, but when you put it on your hand, I swatched it, it was like, you could, um, mute it down, which I wouldn't wear it that purplish, but I got Snob anyhow, because I ran out. And it's that real pretty. And honestly, from my Inglot, that's what I want to tell you guys. Real quick. Um, when I got the, uh, I made the order for the two smaller, the Freedom System, the eyeshadow. And, um, the actual, uh, I made the lip palette. And, um, like, I can honestly say that, like, um, these colors are very um comparable if you want to say like i don't know the numbers i will try to because i had got two colors originally because it's really hard when you're going by numbers and you go online and you look at their colors they don't look anything like so they had to kind of help me i tried to like send them um what i did was this one girl liz over in newport beach where i'm in california near l.a I just like swatched all kinds of colors that I normally would wear and she kind of went with that like family of colors to try to get me something not exactly but you know in the same family um so anyhow um like the surf's up baby reminds me of this middle one that I can never get my finger right that one and um I swear it is so similar and Snob is actually like this color right here. And this is more like I would compare this darker pink to like, um, oh gosh, um, maybe not of royalty, but like a, like a, whoa. what color am I thinking of? Maybe like, uh, I don't know, I'll let you guys know when I remember, when I do like try to dupe the colors, I'll show you. And then these two at the far end over here are like cream cup and compatible, oh my gosh, look at I just, I just dented it, you see that? It's okay. Um, but uh, yeah, like let me see if it'll swatch since I already did that. It even looks kind of like, that one even looks kind of like, um, like this right here is Snob, and this one right here, just that it's a little bit more glossy, is, uh, that last, it looks like pink, but it, it, it comes off more like a lilac pink. I wish you could see it better. It's more, um glossy where the other one's more matte so 
that's the only difference but yeah so um you know you can these are pretty similar to like matte colors I've noticed so that's why I didn't pick up the purple that I was going to get from the Surf's Up Baby but what I did get name move on real quick um is the uh it's the Studio Care Blend Pressed Powder and I got it in gold go lightly because the other color that they had is a more of a reddish brown so yeah for my skin type um skin tone um which i'm looking on the computer and i can see it's pretty true to color like this is you know me with no makeup no primer no nothing um got this color and it's really pretty i love like the whole mac uh logoing all over i don't even want to like really mess it up <laughs> but um it they tried it on me and they they matched me and um it's a really 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 pretty um it has very light sheen but it's matte and i don't know if you can see that but it doesn't look orange like i don't think on any i think it'd be pretty flattering on light to medium um and i think maybe the other a little bit darker which is not a lot darker you can just tell it has a little bit more red undertones would be good for like a darker tone a uh, darker skin tone but i really love this so i got that and the only other things i got were um those other two but those are just like things because i ran out um were it's the uh summer stash maybe you could read that right there and the other one is more of the blue colors i chose more of like of course the neutral colors which the first one to me is more like naked but it's not naked because it's kind of like maybe a tinge of pink but um more on like the lightest of the champagne then you have one that's more like a a subtle baby baby bronze champagne and then um this really 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 beautiful uh purple that kind of the flex in it turn and then a really deep chocolate with like bronze uh, gold flex in it which you know you guys all know i'm like so in love with like browns and and neutral colors and for pops of color i use like cranberries and um plums and purples and that's how I get my you know kind of coloring in there if not I'm using like a straight neutral one color it would be Stila Sun or a really light bronze um, color just all over like not mixing any other colors and just to highlight under my brow bone but um I really I mean this is like 30 36 but if you think about it the you know the pigments are like 1950 and you're really not going to use those pigments like you know i don't know how you would but so i got those from the surf's up baby collection and then since summer's coming i needed a new pair of glasses so they were having a big sale so i got some coach sunglasses and um, i liked them just because it's they're not that dark as you can see and um i like the thinness of the band i don't really like those really thick ones and um yeah right now they're having like really big sales and since my daughter's going to be in soccer and anyways just to cover your eyes um got these i did see some other ones i like but um i have to see it i might exchange them but um, okay Moving on to like colors that I've been wearing, like nail polish colors, is um, I guess just because our weather's been so weird here in California, like it'll be gloomy and then cold and then warm and I don't know, I'm just like we're at the end of May, like it should be warm over here and I guess I can't complain because it's like way worse in other areas, but um, the Lucky Lucky Lavender is definitely um, one of my favorites, like um 
it will be like for the summer and also got a lot of compliments on the Havana Dreams by Sephora OPI and they're both uh, by OPI and I was going to take this one back I had gotten it from Ulta it's like $7.99 it's more of a pinky lilac as opposed to the um the uh trying to get like good lighting so you can see the difference it's more like in the pinky tone the only problem is is that um this one took like about to get this color out of the bottle took about three to four coats um so you know you're basically wasting quite a lot just to do your 10 fingers and if you do one to your toes um you know but I was like, okay, do I really want to waste gas? Because gas out here is really high to go take it all the way back for $7, I believe. So I was like, well, maybe I'll just keep it. It's called Tickle Me. I would give this out of five stars a two. Um, but, you know, what are you going to do? So another thing that I wanted to share with you guys is you. everybody has to have one of these. I, like do my toes a lot and my nails and they're kind of growing and they're all different lengths because I just broke this one the other day because I meant to cut them down and these are my real nails and this one broke too but um yeah like look at this pinky that needs to that sucker needs to like be cut down and um so anyways I came across these at a little boutique uh where I live I don't know what they're called because there's no name on them it's just like there's nothing but I used to go through emery boards like crazy and um, these are like a crystal I don't know what this is made of honestly like a plastic but the girl said there that they never get dull and um, I've gotten a lot of these like for my mom um, me my grandmother everybody when they come they're like Jeff probably you know and I, I give it to them like, whoa, what's this? And then when they try it, they're like, oh my god, that's so neat. So I have this big daddy for, you know, when you just want to get that nail and just, you know. And um, I swear, this thing never dolls up. And I got this cute little one for my purse. And look at the little sandals. I just thought, like, oh my gosh, Summer, where are you? And, um... They have different ones where like, you know, obviously this is like a tie-dye, like the orange to like the pink to the light pink and um, I don't know, I just like things that are bright. Um, but I just thought this was so cute and they have like some that will say grandma, um, mom, um, little different designs, little frogs, uh, little seashells. I don't know if they're like actually maybe someone makes them. I don't know. I'm going to have to ask the girl but I will definitely if I find out you know, where they get them or order them, um, I'll let you guys know, but these are so good to have, and they're cute, um, and then I went to Victoria's Secret, which I know I should know, but, um, anyhow, um, I did get a bra and panties, because they're having, like, their semi-annual sale, well, it hasn't really started, but they had some things on sale, that's why I got them, so I got this one called Love Addict, and it's fresh strawberry and almond milk and oh my gosh it smells so good i got that and then um another thing i wanted to tell you that i i buy samples a lot or get them and try them before i try the actual product product is dr uh, brandt the de, um detoxygen experience and you can get two uses out of this and man this is really good this is like the one that you leave on and rinse off and then this is the cream that you leave on really good product highly recommend okay i know this video is running long but i've been using a lot too is the inglot lip in 38 highly pigmented love 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 it it seems like i haven't used it but i swear it's so pigmented that's all you need and got like two wings this is the hibiscus which is real turquoise and this is the rose just real quick but anyways you guys i hope you like my things have a great weekend talk to you soon bye